okay so this is the another Daikin unit we are working on today uh, this has no heat issue and the thermostat was blank no display so this could be a electrical issue so I'm gonna open up the electrical panel and check okay so the electrical panel is open now uh, nothing going on with the ignition board LED nothing so we're gonna check the incoming high voltage power okay line one line two clock clock 600 volt okay line two line three 600 a box okay line one and line three 600 so we have proper incoming power let's check the low voltage so this is our R and C nothing so there is no low voltage so uh, we have to check the transformer where is the transformer here oh, this one here okay Let's check within this terminal. Uh, this terminal here to ground. Oh, it's very hot. Okay, that's a high voltage. Okay, I'm gonna check the transformer base. It's very difficult to check holding one hand with the mobile and other hand with the lead. Okay, so I have pulled out the fuse. You can see the burn mark here. I don't know if you can see or not. Uh, this is the new one. 3 amps. 3 amps. I'm gonna put the fuse there because I uh, haven't seen any burn mark or something on the low voltage side okay let's put it there the power is off okay it's in okay let's give it a shot nothing So burnt. I haven't checked it was good or not. Maybe I didn't check. Okay, so this time I took the red line of from the thermostat side disconnected if with the <coughs> main connection R and now you can see here a full solid LED let's check the solid is okay or not okay, okay so the solid means normal operation if you can see here the list of first one solid means normal operation I have jumped the R to W but still R from the thermostat is disconnected let's turn on oh so the fuse blew up something is not right okay so after burning three fuses I opened up all the safeties here check the rollout switch to ground everything was okay but when i open up this high limit the high limit is inside here it's very hard to open up this the whole panel because to take this out i have to open that one and the that one the top panel so i just slide it in and 
here I found that uh, it was pinched up between the panels so it was touching to the main body of the unit so still in the contact but it's not good I'm gonna patch this connection properly and just for to test it I have jumped the R2W also I reconnected the thermostat R wire to the terminal everything looking okay that's the damage on here turn on power okay so the fuse is okay phantom motor started yes wait for the roll motor motor will start soon okay. so I'm gonna repair that so unit is working so that was a low 24 volt short on the high limit to the ground so that's it so now